So this video is still in a chapter of algebra of square matrices and now we introduce the concept of commuting matrices. So if I have a matrix A and a matrix B, when do we say that A and B commute? Well, we say that if A times B is equal to B times A, then we say that matrices A and B, they commute. Of course, this condition uh, applies only for square matrix of the same order, right? Uh, otherwise, this couldn't, could not happen, okay? So the, the matrix, they have to be uh, matrix A and matrix B, they have to be N by N. So if we have matrix A, 1, 2, 3, 4, and matrix B, 5, 4, 6, 11. Let us see what is matrix A B times B, and let us see what is matrix B times A. So A times B will be 17, 26, 39, and 56, and B times A is 17, 26, 39, 56. So we can say that these two matrices they commute because A times B is equal to B times A. So we are all we are introducing here the concept of uh, matrices that commute. Okay, please don't think that this is going to happen all the time, right? Because uh, matrices is the very first uh, non-commutative ring that a, u a student usually. Uh, finds for the very first time in his life, okay? Not always this happens, okay? You change one number here and everything changes. So when this happens, and most of the time it doesn't, so when this happens, we say that matrix, matrix A and B, they commute. So now we introduce the concept of power of, of matrices. Let us say we have a matrix M, and that matrix is, for instance, 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, what is, for instance, M squared? Well, M squared is M times M. So if you want to find this result, you just do 1, 2, 3, 4, and you multiply by itself, okay, and then you get the result here. So that's a square matrix, okay. As you can see, if the dimension of the matrix is bigger, and if the power is bigger too, we are going to get into a lot of calculations here, okay. So in linear algebra, all the tricks and tools that help you to find quickly powers of matrices are welcomed, okay? Because this is this is really heavy, okay? If M is a five by five uh, matrix and the power of five, you see, you're going to do calculations all night if if you do it by hand, of course. Okay. Now, some definitions. m to the power of 0 is equal to the identity uh, matrix, okay? And obviously, that m to the power of 1 will be the matrix itself, okay? And now, uh, m squared is m times m. So you keep on and you will get to the point where m to the power of r plus 1 is going to be the same as m times m to the power of r. Okay, and you can define this recursively. Okay, so now we are going to get into a couple of videos 
where we are going to work with powers of matrices.